This is Maple Street, and this, say residents, is exactly what they're dealing with all of the time. The Manchester Motor Speedway is how a lot of folks uh, refer to these two roads. The Courier Museum hosted a neighborhood discussion Wednesday about the crashes. But this is more than just a pretty setting. The museum says it's impacted by dangerous driving too. This is an ongoing problem. The museum has asked uh, the city um, to look into this problem for more than 10 years. Residents shared horror stories. One man said his porch had been wrecked three times since he moved into the neighborhood. I've had a school bus run into the front of my house. If I did not have a stone house, it would have been right through the living room. And it was an Easter seal bus filled with children on their way to the Easter Seals. Speed analysis by DPW reveals that between 2006 and 2015, Manchester had 31 fatal accidents. Of those, 29% involved intersections with at least one one-way street. These neighborhood highways uh, must be made safer. Um, we just cannot in good conscience allow them to remain as they are. One mother said she's seen over a dozen accidents in front of her house in just four years but was worried about the cost of making a change. When I consider investing in our city, I just, I look at our needs and it's this or that. And for me, it's not this. Back live now, another opportunity for public input happens a week from tonight, next Wednesday, April 18th, six o'clock at the Courier Museum. We are live in Manchester this evening, Amy Cavino, WMUR News 9.